In this episode of 10 Best Ones, we are going to check out the top 5 best soundbars in 2018. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I tried to list them based on their price, quality, durability and more. If you want to see the price and find out more information about these soundbars, you can check out the links down in the description and the comment section below. Ok, so, let's get started with the video. At number 5, we have the JBL Bar, 5.1. The JBL Bar 5.1, is one of the best options that you can find on the market, if you're looking for a quality play bar, that comes with a wireless subwoofer, which offers great value for the price. From a design perspective, the JBL Bar features a drilled, black metal body, that is finished with metallic trims, and wrapped in a perforated mesh. At the top, there are four dedicated buttons for volume, input source, and power, while at the back, there are the connectivities, so you can find a USB port, one aux, one optical port and three HDMI ports of which you can take an advantage in order to connect all your 4K devices. As you can see, you will be well equipped in terms of connectivities, so I have to admit that the JBL has done a really good job here. Moving on, when you open the box, you will also see a 10-inch wireless subwoofer, mount brackets, and two detachable battery-powered, surround speakers, that will offer you 10 hours of playtime, which is really cool, if you ask me. Before we move to the next section, I'd like to inform you that we will be more focused on the play bar, so I will only mention that the subwoofer can produce a really punchy bass, that will surely enrich your listening sessions. But now, let's talk about the performance. The JBL Bar 5.1 features the well-known JBL SoundShift technology, which will let you switch between a Bluetooth-connected phone or tablet, from your TV. Moreover, the soundbar itself, is 3-channel, with 9 drivers, and a dedicated center channel, that will help you hear perfectly defined dialogues from any movie you intend to watch. So, when you pair it with the subwoofer, you will enjoy the benefits of having a 5.1 channel system, that can output a total system power of 510 watts, for your ultimate experience. I'd also want to inform you that the soundbar is programmed to work with any TV remote according to the manufacturer, so I think that you won't find any remarks regarding the performance and the compatibility. To conclude, I highly recommend you the JBL Bar 5.1, because it combines an affordable price with a premium performance. Moving on, at number 4, we have the LG SJ9. The LG SJ9 would be a really good option for every audiophile who wants to invest in a soundbar that has a Dolby Atmos support, without spending over $1,000. From a design perspective, the SJ9 sports an attractive gunmetal gray finish, that packs aluminum grills, curved ends, and three silver strips that stretch along the bottom, giving it a really handsome look. At the front, you will find an LED display, that will will show you the current input, while at the back, there are six dedicated buttons for power, volume, pairing with other speakers, connecting to Wi-Fi, and input selection. In terms of connectivities, you will find an HDMI 2.0 input and output which support HDCP 2.2, 4K, HDR, and 60P pass-through, as well as an optical, HDMI arc, and a 3.5mm mini jack, which is pretty good. I'd also want to inform you that this unit has a built-in Wi-Fi, Bluetooth 4.0, Chromecast and Spotify, so you can stream audio from compatible apps, without being restricted to anything. Moreover, this unit comes with a wireless subwoofer, so when you pair it with the soundbar, they can output 500 watts of power, and create a 5.2.1 channel sound. Now, let's talk about the features. The soundbar is CTA certified, and it can produce a consistent, well-defined and in-depth stereo audio at up to 24-bit, which is awesome for its cost. According to the users, both the subwoofer and the soundbar are quality enough to produce an immersive audio that can fill a whole room easily. Or to be more precise, the dialogue quality is perfectly understandable, while the treble and the mids are really defined, so if you ask me, the LG SJ9 worths every penny spent. However, let's not forget that the bass is widely present, so for example, if you're watching action movies, the sound of the gunfire and the explosion will surely enrich your movie sessions. 
Overall, the LGS J9 is worthy of considering, and if you ever decide to purchase it, you would never regret your decision. Next stop, at number 3, we have the Sonos Playbar. The Sonos Playbar is a wireless high-end soundbar, that would be a great addition to your existing home theater system, because it has everything necessary that guarantees rich audio quality, that will be spread across your entire room. From a design perspective, the Sonos features a low-profile multi-positional design, which means that you can place it flat on a tabletop or mount it on your wall, but regardless of how you're going to place it, the play bar will remain responsive, so you can operate it however you want. But what caught my attention about its design, is that this play bar is covered in a soft fabric grille, while the other parts are constructed of an aluminum, which is really cool, since most of the soundbars are made of plastics. The connectivities are extremely simple. There are only two Ethernet ports, an optical audio input, and a power port which doesn't come as a surprise since Sonos always plays simple. But now, let's talk about its performance. The Sonos Playbar uses nine Class D digital amplifiers, which are cleverly tuned in order to match those nine dedicated speaker drivers that are responsible for delivering the sharpest and the most defined sound you will ever hear. You can take an advantage of the Sonos app as well, and use its options such as the speech enhancement, that will focus more on the dialogue, while keeping the volume of the sound effects, on an appropriate level. Another interesting feature is the night sound, which will suit you the best when you're watching a TV, so the delivered sound, will not be that loud to wake your neighbors. This device also works with Amazon Alexa and Echo, so except using your smartphone for controlling this unit, you can also use your speech, since it is a more convenient approach. Before we end, I want to inform you that the Sonos will let you have an access to over 30 streaming services, such as TuneIn, Napster, SoundCloud, Spotify and many more, so you can listen to whatever you want. To conclude, you should definitely take this device into a serious consideration because it is capable to elevate your listening experience to a whole new level. At number 2, we have the Yamaha YSP-5600. The Yamaha YSP-5600 is among the best soundbars that you can find on the market, and even though it has been around a couple of years, it has succeeded to maintain its position on the top. So, let's get quickly into action, and find out what's the reason behind this. From a design perspective, the YSP-5600 has a sturdy, solid build, all-black metal body, that packs 44 beam drivers and two woofers at the inside, with the intention to deliver a real 7.1.2 channel multi-dimensional sound, that will leave you speechless. The front part of the unit is wrapped with a wire mesh, that protects the drivers, while on the top, there are the controls of which you can take an advantage, in order to do adjustments. Also at the front, there is a blue LED display, which is a great addition, but the only remark I have it, is that it is highly protected, so it is a bit hard to read. At the back, there are four HDMI inputs with 4K and 60p pass-through, one HDMI output, one coaxial, two optical, and a pair of analog inputs, an IR input, an IR pass-through output, and an RS-232 port, so they are plenty indeed. I would also want to inform you that this model works with Alexa, so if you have such a device, you can control it via your speech, but you can also operate it via Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, so you can't simply ask for more. Now, let's talk about the features. The YSP-5600 produces a highly immersive sound, which is highly praised by the customers in the market. The reason behind this is that, all of its 44 beam drivers, and the two woofers, are strategically positioned, and they use the Yamaha Digital Sound Projector technology, which functions really smart. Or to be more precise, each speaker is controlled by individual delay times, and interestingly, each of them is driven with its own independent amplifier circuit. In addition, this unit supports the latest surround DTSX and Dolby Atmos formats, so you will be equipped with everything. The YSP-5600 is a must-have, so give it a try, and assure yourself of its capabilities. And finally, at number 1, we have the Sony ST5000. The Sony ST5000, is an extremely good option for every hardcore audiophile, who wants to invest in a quality playbar, that comes with a wireless subwoofer, which when combined, produce 800 watts of power. 
From a design perspective, the ST5000 looks exceptionally beautiful with its black finish, that is accompanied by two gold-rimmed coaxial speakers, that are set on the far left, and on the far right side, while at the center, there is a coaxial driver with mid-range cones, that look as good as they perform. At the front, you will also notice the display, which will always notify you, about the input you're using, as well as the volume, so you will always be informed about everything. The connectivities consist of three HDMI inputs, an HDMI ARC, an optical digital, a USB port, Ethernet port, and 3.5mm stereo analog inputs. In addition, all of the three HDMI inputs support a 18 gigabits per second bandwidth, and they support HDCP 2.2 for 4K HDR content, so I have to admit that Sony did a perfect job here. I'd also want to inform you that this unit is Bluetooth and Wi-Fi enabled and has a built-in Spotify and Chromecast compatibility, which is always welcome. But now, let's talk about the performance. The Sony ST5000 supports DTSX audio via firmware update, so this technology will let you hear, a multi-dimensional and a lifelike audio, that will completely immerse you, and everyone who is around you. Moreover, this model is great for multi-room listening, since all you have to do is just download the Sony Music Center Smart App, and start streaming your favorite tracks in every part of your home. The included wireless subwoofer can really enrich the overall audio quality, because it is capable enough, to produce a punchy bass, that is always wanted, whether you're watching movies, or listening to music. Moving on, the 7.1.2 speaker channels, use the S-Force Pro front surround technology, which according to Sony, can create a natural, three-dimensional sound feel, that will be produced by the soundbar and the subwoofer. However, some users claim that, they Sony isn't that far from the truth, but they have overly praised it, which is normal. To conclude, I would suggest you consider this model seriously, because it can elevate your user experience to a whole new level. Thanks for watching, I hope you liked this video. If this video was helpful to you, please remember to leave a like and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this in the future, and if you have any questions related to these soundbars, you can leave a comment down below and I will get back to you as soon as I can.